Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Eleni and I'm a third year dental student. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome to my channel. I do weekly vlogs of my life in dental school so you guys can get an inside look into what dental school is like. It's just past 11 and I'm in the library. I don't have any patients today, which is really exciting, but I do have ortho rotation today at 1 p.m. So I gave myself a relaxing morning. I slept in and now I'm at the library just doing some busy work, but I'm gonna start off by writing in my passion planner. You guys know I love writing in my passion planner to start off the week, get organized. So I write in all my classes, everything that's going on. So I'm gonna start off by doing that. So this week I have ortho rotation today at one, and then this week I have my pros competency and endo competency. Um, these are the uh, board exam like simulation. So we're going to be taking the board exams in August for pros and endo. So basically, these competencies that we're taking this week are supposed to help prepare us for the one in August. Um, and then the second clinical board exam will be next March, I think, and that will be for um, operative and perio. So we're just like getting started preparing for these boards exams. And I'm also starting to study for my written board exam um, that I'm gonna be taking end of March. Well, it's on a computer, but it's still like the written portion. So like I have to study the material and um, I take it on a computer at like a testing center, but I'm gonna start studying because I'm gonna be taking it end of May. So I'm giving myself two months to study um, for the INDBE, which is what it's called, Integrated National Boards Exam. So yeah, it's um, almost 12, so I ordered some lunch from Avon Pan. I'm gonna go pick it up, eat my lunch, and then get changed for ortho. I have it from one to four, and I think we just basically um, assist a resident so it should be pretty chill and then afterwards I might go to the lab for a little bit and then 5 30 I have core power yoga so I'm excited for that uh, I've been doing the two weeks free so this is my last free week at core power yoga but I've been loving it um, it's been really good so I'm gonna go get my lunch and I have ortho rotation at 1 so I will check in with you guys later hey guys it's just past nine i did core power yoga and took a shower had dinner um, started some laundry, but now I'm going to start studying for boards. Um, I'm going to take this diagnostic test first, and then I'm going to start jumping into the videos, and I'm just going to go through all the videos slowly in the next couple of weeks. Um, so yeah, I'm using Crack the INDBE to study, and I'm starting my studying now because I'm going to be taking the boards end of May. So I will take you guys along with my journey of studying for the boards. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to be going through each section of the videos that they have, going through each video, taking notes. Um, and that's basically how I'm going to be studying for the boards. And I'll let you guys know how I do as I progress. And they have flashcards here. Um, so I'm going to be practicing with the flashcards as well as I go through the videos. So. I think this will be a great resource. I will link it down below so you guys can check it out if you're interested um, for when you're studying for the boards. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna get into studying. But first, I have one thing to show you guys. I'm actually wearing my Coco Floss sweater that I got, but I did get another package from Coco Floss, so I wanted to open it to show you guys. Oh, 
Oh, what is this? Oh, these are so cute. They sent these cute little earrings. They're like pink. They sent these cute sparkly pink earrings that are so cute. And then something in here. This is so cute. Cocoa Floss Minis and there's like a little bunny and it's like a little egg carton. <gasps> oh! They just sent a bunch of mini little Cocoa Floss of all the different flavors. So there's mint, strawberry, sweet pineapple, um, watermelon. Oh, this is so cute. And it came in a little egg carton. How cute is that? So I'm excited to try all of these. I think my favorite flavor so far has been the summer watermelon. This has been my favorite one so far, the watermelon. And I also really like the strawberry. Hey guys, it's Tuesday afternoon. It's around six o'clock. I'm headed to CVS right now because I have to have my TB test read. But today was such a great day. I woke up late. I got to have a morning to myself. I didn't have any patients this morning. And then I went into school and they had a Dunkin' Donuts pop-up. So I got free coffee and a free donut, which was so cool. And then I was taking an NPE for one of my classmates, a new patient exam, but no one showed up. So I got to do lab work and get all caught up. And now I'm here, I'm back home so I can go do this TB test, have it read. I have to do it every year for school. So I'm gonna go to CVS now and have it read and then come back and do work, have dinner. Um, but it's just so beautiful outside and it's so nice. So it just made my day. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna head to CVS and I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Hey guys, it's around eight o'clock now. I just had dinner and watched some TV, but I'm gonna get organized for the night and I think I'm gonna study a little bit. I think I'm gonna study a little bit for the boards. I am taking it in May, like I said before. So I need to start studying and like get into it. Um, so I think I'm gonna start watching another video tonight. I started watching one yesterday, so I'll be watching another one tonight but I wanted to show you guys. I ordered, um, so we have a clinical reference guide and it basically tells us how to do everything in the clinic. So I printed it out and um, I printed it at FedEx and it was only like $20. And I think I use like a thicker paper so you could probably get it even cheaper with like a thinner paper. Um, but yeah, it basically tells us everything we need to know for clinic, like how to schedule appointments, what to do for certain appointments, like complete dentures, RPD, um, basically everything we need to know. So I wanted to print it out just so I have it like this because I had previously printed out each paper, each page, and then put it into a binder, but I feel like I want to change it up and use this instead. So I thought this was pretty cool um, to print out. But yeah, I think I'm gonna get organized for the night, look at appointments, stuff like that, get ready for tomorrow and study a little bit. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get into that and I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, it's Wednesday night, it's just after nine. Today was such a long day. I had school from 9 a.m. until seven. This morning I did a scaling and then at one o'clock I was supposed to be doing a final impression for a bridge but we ended up finding some caries on some of the teeth um on one of the abutment teeth and then a tooth that's like next to the bridge so i had to take out the cavity and um do a composite filling and then we ended up not having time for the impression so we'll do it at another appointment um and then at 4 30 i had my competency for Process, which was to simulate what the CDCA exam is going to be like. So we had three hours to prep number nine, number five, and number three. And I knew it was going to be a time crunch, so I worked really fast and ended up having like extra time. So I was able to like look everything over. So hopefully I passed. The only hard part was 
the lingual of number nine for me. Um, I just like feel like I didn't get it right, so I might get points off for that. Um, but hopefully I still passed. But yeah, it's basically preparing us for the CDC exam, which is going to be in August. Um, so that's going to be a pros endo um, board exam. And then I have my endo competency on Friday at one o'clock. So um, yeah, I have that Friday. But um, tomorrow should be a pretty easy day. My patient for one o'clock canceled and I just have a 9 a.m. and it's just a perio follow-up, so it should be pretty quick. Um, and then in the afternoon, since I don't have anything, I'm gonna go see an apartment because I'm gonna move to Southie for my last year and I'm really excited. So we're looking into apartments and I'm gonna live with my boyfriend so yeah, I'm really excited to be moving to Southie. Um, and then hopefully I'll do a core power yoga at 5.30, which reminds me I need to sign up if I'm not already signed up. I've been doing the two week core power yoga and it's been amazing, I've loved it. Um, but yeah, right now I'm just gonna try and get organized. I'm editing a vlog, so hopefully I can put it up tonight. But I wanna get organized and make a to-do list so I know what I need to do for tomorrow because um, I'll have some time tomorrow afternoon after we go see the apartment. Um, but yeah, nothing much going on. And I want to go to bed soon because I'm exhausted and I have to wake up early again tomorrow. Luckily on Friday I just have... Oh no, Friday I have an appointment in the morning and then the endo competency at 12.30. So Friday will also be a pretty busy day. But yeah. And I'm supposed to be starting for boards, but I just haven't had the time or the energy. So I need to find time to study for it. Um, but yeah, I'm going to do a little work and head to bed soon. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow.